Hello all, welcome to session 80 of Software Testing Made Easy course. In this session, I'm going to explain about system testing. So let's get started. System testing is one of the levels of software testing, which comes after the unit testing and integration testing. But what exactly is this system testing? Testing performed on the complete system is known as system testing. Testing that is performed on the complete system or entire system or whole system is known as system testing. But who will be performing this system testing? Software testers are the one, okay? Who will be performing this system testing? Software testers are the one who will be performing this system testing. They'll be testing the entire system. Software testers will be testing the entire system. As you can see here, unit testing and integration testing are generally done by the developers. But coming to the system testing, testing will be performed on the entire system by the software testers. For example, there's an application like this. Okay, this application is given for testing. Who will be performing the testing on this application, guys? Developers or testers? Testers will be performing testing on this entire application. And also, this system testing falls into the black box testing category. Why? Why system testing falls into the black box testing category? As you can see here, here the software testers cannot see the code that is developed for building this application, right? The code written for developing this application is not visible to the software testers. That's why the system testing falls into the black box testing category. But coming to the unit testing and integration testing, they fall into the white box testing category because developers can see the code while performing the unit testing and integration testing. But coming to system testing, software testers cannot see the code that was used for building the application or developing the application. That's why system testing falls into the black box testing category. And there are different types of testings that software testers will perform as part of this system testing. That is functional testing, non-functional testing, UI testing, and usability testing. Let me explain each of these testing types now. Coming to functional testing. Here, as part of system testing, software testers will perform the functional testing by checking whether the functionality of this application is working according to the requirements or accordingly or not. For example, if the software testers have to test the login functionality of this application, initially they will enter the valid credentials into this uh, login page and click on the login. If using the valid credentials, if the user is able to log in, okay, the functional test is passed. Similarly, they will enter some invalid credentials and try to log in. If the application is not allowing this invalid credentials to log in, then the functionality of this login is working perfectly. So this is how guys software testers will perform the functional testing. That is just a sample guys. Whatever I explained here as part of the login is just a sample of performing the functional testing. Here we are checking whether the functionality of the application is properly built or not according to the requirements or not, okay? Properly working or not. All these things will be checked as part of the functional testing. But what exactly is non-functional testing? In non-functional testing, instead of testing the functionality or functioning of this particular application, software testers will test the characteristics of the application, like performance of this application, like uh, what is the performance of this application? It's low or kind of speed only, okay? Kind of thing. So second thing is like security, okay? How secure is this particular application? This is all about the characteristics, guys. It's not about the functioning of the application, but uh, how how speed this application is running and uh, what is the security, okay? Security level of this application, security features implemented as part of this application. Everything will be tested as part of the non-functional testing. UI testing is all about the visibility, okay? The view of this application, like how this application looks, look and feel of this application, okay? Whether the things are aligned properly or not, uh, proper fonts are given, proper colors are given, such kind of testing is known as UI testing. Then coming to the usability testing, how easy it is for the users to use this particular application. That will be tested by the software testers as part of the usability testing. How easy or understandable this particular application is for using purpose for the real end users that will come as part of the usability testing guys. So hope guys, you understood what exactly is system testing. Testing performed on the complete or entire or whole system by the software testers is known as system testing. So that's it guys. Thank you. Bye.